Good afternoon. We would like to uh, welcome you to Oasis Connection Ministry Prayer Chat. I want to thank you for joining us today. This is such a beautiful day, and we just give God all the glory, all the honor, all the praise, you know, because without him, we're nothing. And he right. is the one who designed this day. This is the day that the Lord has made, and we will rejoice and be glad in spite of what we're going through, uh, in spite of what we see going around in this world, we still rejoice and glad because we know God is in control. God is a God that never changes. His word does not change. His word is truth. His word does, do, does not lie. And so we just stand on his word. We stand on his word. I want to read Jeremiah 7, 7. It says, blessed is the one who trusts in the Lord, whose confidence is in him. They will be like a tree planted by the water that sends out its root by the stream. And um, I just want to just be, want you to just be thankful and just trust God, trust him no matter what you're going through. I want to pray especially today for um, our, our parents and our schools. Um, parents are coming in to our school system. We have new kids coming in. We have uh, old students returning and there, there have been some uh, situations that have caused them to not trust. And so I just want to pray for God's hand and his light to shine on them and help them to continue to trust us and to trust God, knowing that he has their children in his hand. Lord, I just thank you right now, Lord God. I thank you, Lord God, for every family member, every scholar, every student across this world, in every school system, colleges, universities, wherever they are attending school, this is the season where they're returning to school. I just thank you for them, oh God, and I just pray, oh God, that you would just bring a peace in their hearts and their minds and their spirits, knowing, oh God, that you have them in the palm of your hand, that they can continue to trust you in spite of what they see going on around this world. Your hand is not short. You can, you still have them in your hand. And I thank you, Lord God, that your peace would rule and reign in their spirits and their heart. Help them to depend on you in spite of what they may be going through, I pray, Lord God, for every classroom all across this world. I pray, Lord God, that your Holy Spirit would guide and lead the teachers, uh, help them to depend on you, give them insight on what they need to speak to the kids, how to help them to develop social, socially and emotionally and what they may be experiencing, help them to uh, build that community in their classrooms in order for students to learn. I just thank you right now, Lord God. I thank you, Lord God, right now in the name of Jesus that you touch every heart, every young heart that's coming to school, oh God. Help them to receive what needs to be, rece help them to be receptive for what they need to receive uh, in the classroom, academically, uh, emotionally spiritually, whatever it is, oh God, I thank you, Lord God, that you would help them, you would cover them, you open their mind, oh God, help them to absorb and to, to be like sponges to receive whatever you want them to receive in Jesus name. And I pray for teachers, oh God, I pray, Lord God, for every teacher, oh God, Father, we have some teachers, oh God, that are, they're in, they're in situation, they looking for finances, they looking for increases in their finances, God, help them to know, oh God, that you have called them. You've called them into this area for such a time as this, and you will provide. You are their provider, oh God. I just pray, Lord God, every provision for teachers' lives will be met, oh God. Help them not to focus on the financial aspect, of, but to focus on what you've called them to do, and you will provide that little increase that they're looking for. God, I pray, oh God, that you would find a way, oh God, to help them to provide for their family as they're providing for others, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, I thank you, Lord God, for all those out there that are serving all across this world in the education field. I thank you for their servant hearts, oh God. I thank you, Lord God, that you would continue to give them strength, oh Father, 
in the name of Jesus. So God, I pray, oh God, that you would just continue to help them to walk, walk in boldness, oh Father, knowing, oh God, that your hedge of protection is around them, oh Father. They're safe in you in the name of Jesus, oh God. I thank you for what you're doing and what you're going to mm -hmm. do, oh Father. In the name of Jesus, oh God. And I want to pray, Lord God, for family members, uh, parents that may be preparing their scholars for school and don't have the finances, oh God. Father, we know, Lord God, that this is a, 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 a world. There are so many things changing. But I pray, oh God, for the families to receive what they need, oh Father, whether it be school supplies, mm -hmm. oh God, clothing, mm -hmm. Father God, whatever it is, oh God, mm -hmm. that you would find a way, you put them in connection with organizations, oh Father, uh, support groups, food pantries, whatever they need, oh God. I thank you, great God, that you, that you would make a way where it seems to be none right now in the name of jesus oh god i thank you lord god i thank you lord god that you cover every family and every provision for their lives would be met right now in the name of jesus oh god and i thank you lord god that you would speak to our own hearts oh god that you would help us oh father to continue to seek your face oh god to seek your face oh god and work, teach us oh father to put put all of our agendas aside, oh God, and to seek you, oh God, to hear you, get, spend more time with you, oh God, to hear what you speak into our spirits, oh Father. Help us, oh Father, to say yes to your will and to your way, oh Father. In the name of Jesus, oh God, I thank you, Lord God, that you continue to turn and shift our hearts, oh God. Our Father God, I pray, oh God, that we would rise up in you, oh Father, in the name of Jesus, oh God. Do what only you could do. Continue to shift our hearts, oh God, and, and to be that person that you call us to be, oh Father, right now. In the name of Jesus, I thank you, Lord God, that you are speaking in ways mm -hmm. that we can't even imagine, oh Father. I thank you, Lord God, for that shifting right now. And we say yes to your will and to your way. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Father, we just come to your, your throne of grace, oh, Father. Yes. Just, just giving you the praise and giving you the glory, Father. Just yes. thanking you for being uh, that the Lord that, um, that you are, loving us, being kind to us, forgiving our sins. Oh, God, and you are the only one, oh, Father, God can, can just... Uh, Clean our hearts today, our oh Father. Yes, God. So clean in us clean hearts and renew the right spirits in us, our oh Father. So, Father God, we know that your word said that we should love you with all our hearts, with all our souls. Yes, Father. With all our mind, oh Father. And Father, it looked like um. I don't know, Father. There's something that's going on, Father. Look like uh, we're we're so far from you, oh God. But you told us to submit to you. Submit to you, Father. Yeah. Learn of you, oh God. And then the devil will free from us, oh Father. And I just thank you, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Just help us to be this light that you call us to be, Father. Help us to seek ye first the kingdom of God and all your righteousness, oh Father. All your righteousness. Not some of it, but you said all your righteousness, Father. So teach us, oh, Father God. Teach us how to love you with all our hearts, oh, Father. And teach us how to love you, Father God, with all our minds. Teach us, oh, God. Teach us. Teach us, oh, Father. Because you told us that you wanted us to have the mind of Christ. And if we have the mind of Christ, Father, we would act like Christ. We would think like Christ. We would behave like Christ. So, Father, I thank you that you gave us a way, oh, Father God. You told us not to be transformed. Oh, Father God, to this word would be transformed by the renewing of our minds. So help us, oh, Father God. Yes, help us, oh, Father, because we need you, oh, Father. We need you. You said righteousness shall adopt a nation. So, Father, we need the righteousness of God, and we know that you're the righteousness of God through Jesus Christ. We know that. We know that. And Jesus, we thank you. And Holy Spirit, we thank you that we got this treasure in earthen vessels, oh, Father God. And we know the one thing, oh, God, that if we 
free. Just let you take over. And if we yield ourselves to your, your spirit, Father God, you will lead us and you will guide us. You will lead us and you will guide us because you told us in the word, Father, if we trust in you with all our heart and not lean to our own understanding, but in all our ways, acknowledge you, you would direct our path. So we know, Father God, that the footsteps of a righteous man are ordered by you. So, Father, I thank you, Father. Help us. Help us to, to be uh, like all the sports and all the, the football teams and basketball teams. They be saying all in. We all in. And 100. Why we can't say that, Father? Why we can't say that as children of God? Why we can't be all in? Why we can't be 100 with you, oh, Father God? Because you said, Father God, when we when when you come in and, 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 and teach the words, you said some will receive from you 30 and some will receive from you 60 and then some will receive from you 100. But it's the condition of our heart, so oh, Father. It's the condition of our heart. How are we going to receive 100, oh, Father God? And I can't understand, Father God, you were teaching the word why some people didn't didn't give a 30%. Why some people didn't get 60%. Why everybody didn't get 30% and you were teaching the word, God. And I don't understand. So help me to understand, Father God. So, Father, I just pray for this nation, Father. I pray for this nation. That the nation, this nation, supposed to be formed on the word of God. You supposed to be the Lord of this nation. So I thank you, for that, Father. So now I just declare and I decree, Father God, you said to be steadfast and immovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord. Always abounding in the work of the Lord. Always abounding. So that means, Father, we should always be praying. We should always be uh, seeking your face. We should always, oh, Father God, We should always be loving you. We should always be trying to be as Jesus is. So as are we in this kingdom. This is what came in my spirit. As Jesus was, so shall we be in this world as kingdom kids. So, Father, I thank you, Father, abounding in the work of the Lord. For as much as you know that our labor is not in vain. So whatever we do. For you, God, if we do it as unto you and not unto man, it would not be in vain. So help, help all of us, oh Father, help all the sisters and brothers, help all the married couples, help all the teachers, help all, oh Father God, the administrators, help all, Father God, the kids, oh Father, help, help us to be children in the light, oh Father God, help us, oh Father God, because Father God. We always conquer the darkness. We, we walk in, light always conquer the darkness. So, Father, let our light shine, oh, Father. And I thank you for that, oh, Father. And I thank you, Father God, in the name of Jesus, oh, Father God, that you continue to help our president, help our nation, all the, all the uh, presidents and the leaders of all this world system, oh, Father. I thank you, Father God, in the name of Jesus, because we know, Father, we know, we know we are in this world, but we, we're we not of this world, Father God. We're just passing through, Father God, and, but you've given us dominion and, and over this world, oh, Father God. You've given us authority over this world, oh, Father God, so we're supposed to be conquering, oh, Father. We, and you said that we are more than conquerors. So let us conquer, God. Let us conquer. Let us, let us take back, oh, Father God. Let us put pressure on on the devil. You said the kingdom of God suffered violent and the violent take it by force. So, Father, let us have passion. Let us have a passion, oh, Father God, to take, take our kingdom back, oh, Father, and let us be children of the light. In Jesus' name, I pray this prayer. Amen, and to God be the glory. Be the glory. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We come before you with a grateful heart. We thank you that you give us the opportunity to come before you on your behalf, my Lord God, that we pray your will, your desire above all things. My God, you say in your word, my Lord God, let not our hearts be troubled. But we believe in God, we also in you. You say, Jesus, you are the way, the truth, and the life. And no man comes to the Father but by you. And we thank you, Lord Jesus, we put our trust in you now, amen. 
know what I'm saying? You above me on anything you can ask or imagine. We thank you, Lord Jesus, that you are all him all of God. The God of God, the supreme God, that's no one yes. even close that can compare to who you are, my Lord Jesus. You and me alone are working, my Lord God. Lord God, you spoke the very world into existence, my Lord Jesus. You said your word, my Lord God, that we have not because we ask not, my Lord God. We come on to ask right now, my Lord God, that you will supply every one of our needs because you said you are to hold a job, my Lord God. I provide, my Lord God. Lord God, you said in your word, my Lord God, that any man lack me, but with you, my Lord God, that as a you, you give to them on the brain. We thank you for who you are, my Lord God. We thank you, my Lord God, that you are Lord Jehovah, Rohi, my Lord God. You are our shepherd, my Lord God. You guys into all truth, my Lord God. We thank you for who you are, my Lord God. You said you are a good shepherd, my Lord God. Lord God, you have said in your word, my Lord God, you get an example of a shepherd that will leave the 99 and find that one, my Lord God. Let know, my Lord God, that those who are running from you, my Lord God, that you are seeking them, my Lord God, that you have a heart after them, my Lord God, you love them so much, my Lord God. That you sent your only son, my Lord, to die for us, my Lord. That many may be saved, my Lord, but you have given us a choice, my Lord. Let us not lead to our understanding, my Lord, but all our ways acknowledge you, and you will direct our path, my Lord. You said in your word, my Lord, that you will, my Lord, never leave enough for seconds, my Lord. You said you would stick with us close to their brother. We thank you for who you are, my Lord Jesus. You said even though our mother and father made mistakes, for seconds, my Lord. But you said you'll always be there, my Lord God. And Lord God, you're not a man that you should lie, not the son of a man that you should repent. If you said it, will come to pass. And we thank you for who you are, my Lord God. Because you and your word are one. And your word will not return to your voice. But we'll come with what you said for the do, my Lord God. Lord God, we thank you, my Lord God, that you do all things, my Lord God. Lord God, to bless those who are returning to school, my Lord God. Bless the children, my Lord God. Supply the needs that they have, my Lord God. Give the parents. Oh, uh, hey, uh, to supply that they need to be in contact with the right people, my Lord God. Give people a heart of compassion, my Lord God, that would give, my Lord God. That none would lack any, my Lord God. They would lack nothing, my Lord God. For every one every vision be met, my Lord God. As to bless the teachers, my Lord God, to prepare for school, my Lord God, the kid prepared to come back, my Lord God. Give them the patience and the understanding that they need, my Lord God. That they meet any child where they are, my Lord God. That they be comprehend everything they set before, my Lord God. That they will have a blessed year, my Lord God. It'll be a year of uncommon blessings, my Lord God. The kids will excel, my Lord God, above and beyond anything they can ask or imagine, my Lord God. This teacher will be amazed by what is going on, my Lord God. They bless those who are, my Lord God, that are suffering, my Lord God, for uh, health problems, my Lord God. You touch them, my Lord God. You be that Jehovah. Rock him, Lord God, Lord, that he will be, Lord God. Touch your physical body, Lord God. Remove any pain, Lord God, that they may have, Lord God. Give the doctors the wisdom that they need to touch each child, each patient on their individual basis, Lord God. Need them where they are, Lord God. Let them not put their trust in just in man, Lord God, but let them trust you also, Lord Jesus. For you have to do all things, Lord God. Right now, Lord God, we thank you for who you are, for what you're doing to and through us, Lord God. Actually, bless the President of the United States, as my sister said, Lord God, that you give an uncommon wisdom, Lord God. God is wisdom, not wisdom of man, Lord God, but your wisdom, Lord God. That they make the right decision, Lord God, concerning this nation as a whole, Lord God, concerning this abortion bill that has passed, Lord God, that we provide alternatives for those who want to keep their children, Lord well, God. But you said children are blessings from you, Lord well, God. You said he knew before we even form our mother's womb. We thank you for who you are, Lord well, God. That the church will come forth, Lord well, God. People are part of compassion, Lord well, God. That will give to those mothers that be in need, Lord well, God, that are undecided what they should do with their children, Lord well, God. They don't put them up for adoption, Lord well, God. But there's so many people that want children, Lord well, God. They're not able to have children, Lord well, God. Amen. In the circumstances, Lord God, but you touch their hearts, Lord God, touch their minds and their spirit, Lord God, they bring their pregnancy and to, to complete terms, Lord God, they will have a healthy child, Lord God, and do the right thing, Lord God. You said, well, you not to shed the blood of the innocent, Lord God, because the angels are always before your throne. And we thank you for who you are, Lord God. As the church of the doctors, Lord God, who are a person, Lord God, change their hearts, Lord God. Give them a heart of compassion, Lord God. Let them walk away from what they're doing, Lord God. Let them know, Lord God. And you say it's best for a man to have a stone tied around his neck and throw it into the sea. You know what I'm saying? Or hurt one of these little ones, Lord Jesus. Yes. And we thank you for who you are, Lord God. Thank you, Lord. Open our eyes, Lord God. Give us the eyes of Christ, Lord God. I to compassion, Lord God. Yes. Give the heart of compassion, Lord God. Let them not be judged, Lord God. Yes, Lord God. Love them more than honor, Lord God. 
Ukraine is still in battle with Russia. Mother God, touch their heart. Draw yes, them. Lord. Mother God, they will come to know the concession, Mother God. They have love one for another, Mother yes, God. Yes, Father. Continue to bless the families who, who lost their homes, Mother God, because of these fires that are running rapidly, Mother God, around the nation, not only in Texas, Mother God, but around the world, Mother God. Yes. I see the touch of Mother God. And she bless those who are losing their home because of flood, Mother God. I keep touching your house also, yes, Mother God. Let them know, Mother God, that you are there, Mother God. Yes. You said you're close as a whisper, Mother God. Yes. Let them not grow weary, Mother God. Let them not run from you, Mother God. Let them yes, come to know you, those who don't know you, Mother God. But come to know you, Mother God. Yes, Knowing that you ain't do all things, Mother God. The above you know, anything they can ask or imagine, Mother God. And that you will use this circumstance, Mother God, for your good, Mother God. Yes, you Mother God. not saying that you caught it, Mother God. For them to uh, suffer, Mother God, but you said you return it for their good. And we thank, thank you for who you are, Mother God, for what you're doing to us and through us. And you're listening for you. So we give you all the glory and all the honor for you and you alone, Lord Jesus, are worthy to receive all glory, all honor, and praise. We thank you for who thank you, you are. God. Yes, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank Lord, you. Let's pray before we end uh, for. Uh, uh, Africa and Kenya, um, the women that are ru running for offices are being harassed and abused. Mm -hmm. And I just, I just want to pray that your hedge of protection yes, will be upon Lord. them. Father, you call women. Yes, you call mm -hmm. women rise up. You call in an army of Deborahs to rise up. Yes, and you yes. need, oh Father. And I just want to pray yes, your Jesus. hedge of protection over the women in Kenya uh, who may be facing these abuse and yes, uh, and just retaliation against them. I pray right now in the name of Jesus, yes, oh God, yes, Jesus. that the blood of Jesus would cover them, yes, oh Father, yes, your yes, hedge of protection yes, would be about them, oh Father, in the name yes, of Jesus, yes, oh God. And Father God, you would just yes, uh, cause those who are doing this to cease right now. Yes, Let yes, them yes. know, oh Father, that your mighty hand is at work, oh Father, yes, and they cannot stop what you are ordaining, oh yes, Father. Yes, in the name of Jesus, oh God, I thank you for your hedge of protection, Jesus, oh God. Yes, I just pray, oh God, for every missionary, oh Father, yes, that yes, might be serving yes, in, in yes, Africa, oh Father, and across yes, this world, oh Father. Yes. God, that you would lead them, you would guide them, you would direct yes, Father. Father, in the name of Jesus, oh God, your head of protection will be about them, oh Father. Help them to continue to spread your word, oh God, to spread the gospel, oh Father. To yes. Make a way, oh Father, for people to know you, oh Father. Help them to get the word out, oh Father. God, give them insight, give them avenues, oh Father. Give them wisdom, oh Father. Give them creative ideas, oh Father, as they serve in, in these different areas and countries all across this world, oh Father. And I pray, oh God, that you would provide for them, oh God, financially, oh God, those that may be. Yes. Blessing, oh God, I pray, oh God, that you would open the windows of heaven for them right now in the name of Jesus, oh God. In your name, Jesus. Vision for their lives would be met, oh Father. Help them, oh Father, to be meet the needs of Father, of those who need to know about you, to need to hear from you, to hear your word, oh Father. I pray, Lord God, that you would cover their homes, oh Father, protection from the from the distraction of the enemy, oh Father. You would cover their families, oh God. You would provide everything that they need, oh Father, right now in the name of Jesus. And I thank you for their servant heart, oh God. I thank you for what they're doing. I thank them for answering the call and say yes to your will and your way. We just give you praise and we give you glory and honor, oh Father, for what you're doing and what you're going to do, oh Father right now in the name of Jesus. And we just want to thank you for joining us today with Oasis Connection Ministry. 
thank you for uh, coming out. And I, we pray that uh, we be able to touch someone's life yes, by that sir. today. And Father, I just pray, oh God, that if we can we covered the schools, we covered what's going on in the world, oh Father. We just pray that you seal it, seal it's this so prayer weird. right now in the name of Jesus, oh God. And we just thank everybody for watching and listening. We pray that you have a blessed week yes, and Lord. God will meet your needs yes, in Jesus' name. Yes, Amen. 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 Amen.